Good evening. We gather with the King of Kings and the Prince of Peace. Let's take a moment or two, recognising that the God of all is welcoming each of us to him now. Romans 1, 7. Grace and peace to you from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Our help is in the name of the Lord who made heaven and earth. The Lord made today. So bring to him what you have on your heart from it as you reflect on it today. Save us, O Lord, while waking and guard us while sleeping that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. A verse from Psalm 2. The psalmist has been talking about why the nations conspire, and at verse 4 writes, The one enthroned in heaven laughs, the Lord scoffs at them. Another version writes, Disconcerting as this is to me, i.e. what's going on with rulers, our great God laughs at their foolish efforts. At times we look round and see all that goes on or parts of it and can feel, Lord, why? These things are dreadful. The wars, the rumours of wars, the way people are treated and abused the poverty that there is, the way powers look for their own power. And we look and wonder at those who plot and conspire. And yet the Lord laughs at them. The Lord looks and sees and knows that their efforts will fail, for he is bigger he is greater and he has the victory. We can be confident that he wins and has won the victory. So we pray. Lord, we bring to you those situations where our hearts cry out. Our hearts cry out for justice. And we thank you that you look and you see and you know and that you are the judge of those whose hearts are turned away from you, whose hearts do not show love, do not show kindness and do not show care. Amen. Visit this place, O Lord, we pray, and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us in peace, and may your blessings be always upon us. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. And we pray, our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. And now may the voice of love, joy and peace be yours this day and every day. May the walls that separate us fall quickly 
in the name of God's love. Amen. Bless you and sleep well.